Hello, this is Equinox for your latest gaming news. In today's video, we will be talking about the new Pokemon added to the new Pokemon games, Sun and Moon. A new Overwatch update that just came out on August 2nd, which celebrated the upcoming Olympic Games. And the first legendary bird that was found in Pokemon Go. So let's begin. In our first story, new Pokemon have been announced for the upcoming Pokemon games. The game will be coming out November 18th, 2016. Some of the new Pokemon that have been added are Oricorio, which can be found in four different forms, Fire, Electric, Psychic, and Ghost. Minior, which is a flying rock type that has the ability Shields Down, an ability that reduces his defense but increases his speed. He can be found in four different colors, yellow, blue, pink, and orange. Next. Young Goose, which was revealed in a previous trailer, got his very own Trumplution, Gumshoes, making Alola great again, one wall at a time. Finally, we have Mudbury. He is the pre-evolution of Mudsdale, and he has the ability's own Tempo and Stamina. This trailer also revealed new Alola form Pokemon and Z-Moves. If you want to watch the full trailer, it will be in the description. In other news, Overwatch got a new Olympic Games update. This update introduces new skins, emotes, victory poses, and many more items, including a new Rocket League-inspired game mode called Lucio Ball. In this new game mode, a team of three Lucios play soccer, using their guns to push the ball around. Most of the skins that were added included a flag of the character's origin country. I understand that there's no Canadian character, but did we really need to be excluded? Anyways, this update won't last long, so make sure to get those skins as soon as possible. Now let's move on to our final story. Articuno was found in Pokemon Go. No, we are not joking. This legendary wasn't found at the top of the Eiffel Tower. It wasn't found at the peak of Mount Everest. It was found in... Ohio. Now don't get me wrong, Ohio is fine, but is it really... legendary enough to host the first legendary bird in Pokemon Go? Possibly, but it wasn't a special event. Articuno was just found in the wild, just like any other Pokemon. Unfortunately for the players, Nantic found out about the legendary and quickly deleted it from the game. They said they did it for fairness sake and that Articuno being in the game was a mistake. But I personally think they just wanted to release in them some big event. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Equinox, and I'll see you guys in the next video.